It's Tuesday, test it Tuesday, where I do a five minute review on a product recommended to me from a social media ad. Today's product is a little different, but before we get into it, don't forget to subscribe to my channel down below. Today I have mud water. Sounds appetizing, doesn't it? It comes in a tin like this, and you just pop the lid off, and this is what the mud looks like that you add to the water. It's like a coffee alternative. It has one seventh the amount of caffeine in a serving as a cup of coffee does. So it's supposed to eliminate like jitters, crashing, different side effects that you get from drinking coffee. It gives you natural energy, focus, and it claims to do a lot more than that. It lists all ingredients right here on the front. I'm not going to try to pronounce them all because I already know I can't. <laughs> it's only 20 calories a serving, which is nice. Here are some of the claims that it makes. It claims to improve your mood, increase alertness, enhance performance, strengthen your immunity, it has anti-aging properties, increase endurance, anti-inflammatory, hydrating, balances your pH, plus it's full of minerals that your body needs. Now, this all sounds great and dandy, but mud water? Mud water? It doesn't sound like anything I want to drink. It comes with this little booklet. It tells you the ingredients. It tells you how to make it. It has a few different recipes you can try. And it also talks about like their creamer that they have, bulk refill bags, Q&A, and yeah. So that's kind of a nice little breakdown that they give you that comes in the box. So let's talk about how much it costs. It's $40 for the ritual kit, which includes shipping. You get the 30 servings, you get the frother, and a free sample of the creamer. That comes out to like, a dollar and 30 some odd cents a day, which isn't bad if you're going to Starbucks and you're getting like $5 coffees every day. You could potentially be saving yourself some money. Me and my husband tried out this product together and here was our initial reactions. You think it smells good? Guys, look gross. I can see. I like it. What's the verdict? I like it. What's it taste like? Does it taste how it smells? Yeah, it smells. It tastes like chai tea. Black Does it chai taste tea. like watery, okay. or is it like? No, it's like watery chai. What do you think, Zorn? Mm. Yeah. Coconut milk and MCT oil creamer. <laughs> Don't like it with the... <laughs> no, it tastes super chalky. No go on the creamer. Creamer's gross. Got it. That was interesting. I think if you like your coffee black, if you're like a tea drinker, it has like a very like earthy taste. So if you like those kinds of things, I think you would really enjoy this. You can add creamer to this. They have different ways you can use it. You can make it bulletproof. You can make it in a shake, smoothie type of a way. I'm just not a huge fan, but I think if I find a way to make it taste how I like my coffee, like super sugary and sweet, then I wouldn't mind drinking this every day. So I'm still playing around with it and testing it out. And all I tried was just mixing it with water and it just straight up tastes like earth. Like it really does. It just has a really like earthy scent and flavor. It's not bad. It's just different. Something you have to get used to. So I think if you're looking for a coffee alternative, maybe check it out. It could be the product for you. I think the price is kind of high. It's a little off-putting, like, whoa, $40, but it's 30 servings, so like you have to think like it's a month's worth, 
if you only have one serving a day, but it's like, ooh, $40 for a tiny can of mud water. So you just have to decide if it's something that you think you would like and you'd want to invest your money in. But um, yeah, I got to keep trying it out. I got to keep playing with the recipes. Well, that's all I have for today's Tested Tuesday. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. You can check out some of my other Test It Tuesdays that I have on the channel. And don't forget to come back next Tuesday for another product review. Bye. <laughs> Since it has so many good, good, in, good organic or ingredients. Oh my gosh, is that a tongue twister?